Hi Capricorn, welcome to your weekly reading for September 25th to October 1st of 2016. I am Renee Michelle and this is my channel here on YouTube, Chronicles of a Hoodoo Spiritist. I want to welcome you all the new subscribers, welcome to the family, welcome to the club. And I thank you guys for the likes, the shares, the comments. If you would like a personal reading with me, you can get one at hoodoospiritistnet.net. Alright Capricorn, let's see what's going on for you this week. Okay, Capricorn, so what's going on beneath the surface? There's a need for rest, right? There's a need for you. This is physical rest. You need to rest. Some of y'all are not sleeping. Some of y'all are sleeping half the time. It is time for you to get some rest. I feel like some of you are working just a little too much where you're picking up over hours, overtime hours, or you have a second job. Some of you are really, really, really need to just take a couple of days off. So coming into this week, I have the eight of clubs and the seven of clubs, right? So it's, you're quickly learning to, start, to, to stand your ground, coming into this week. You no longer want people to bother you. You no longer want people to abuse you. You are standing up for yourself and you're standing up for the people that you love. In the beginning of the week, we have the seven of spades and the six of spades. So the seven of spades is about um, um, trickery or foolery, right? And I feel like you had made plans to just get up and run. Because that's the second meaning. I feel like this is both moving cards. And this is like, I'm just grab whatever I can and leave, right? Because you really and truly want to move. And that's heavy on your mind at the beginning of the week. So as the middle of the week, you know that you're fighting in a battle that you can win as far as gaining more energy, gaining more um, vigor in order to move around and do the things that you need to do to get where you need to get, right? And towards the end of the week, we have the two of spades and the queen of spades. So I feel like you you have a decision. You know that you have a decision to make. You know that you have a choice to make, but you haven't. You're making a blind eye to it. You're pretending like I don't have to make this choice, but subconsciously you know that there's a decision that has to be made. And when I see something like the two of spades, I know that if you are out to make this decision, it's not going to be divine intervention. It's not going to be somebody else making it for you. It's something that you have to make yourself. And I feel like for Capricorn, there's, there's not enough rest to fully sit around and think about the full decisions that they have to make. The outcome of the week, right, is the four hearts and the four clubs. So I feel like you're kind of complacent about being happy. It's like, is there anything else out there? You know what I mean? I don't feel like I'm ever going to be happy in love. I don't feel like I'm ever going to be happy in magic. Marriage, I just feel like it's just a regular everyday thing. All right, then, Capricorn, until next week, stay blessed and I say, you know, I love you. Peace.